I have got no lashes on, no makeup whatsoever. And I'm gonna show you guys how to have your hair grow and how to, to take care of your skin. I'm gonna show you guys some products that I've been using. Um, and basically, how to feel great with just being natural. This is like a highly requested video. It's the products that I'm using in my hair at the minute. So I have, um, this is a shampoo that I'm using. It's from Auntie Jackie and it's called Deep Moisturising and Detangling um, Hair Bath. That some shampoos, they dry my hair out when I use it. So it smells so good. I love the smell of it. I love even when I wash my hair and then I'm like, does anyone else see that? They go like that and you can just smell your hair it smells banging this is so nice because it's got, clearly got some type of moisturizing in it and moisturizing in it what am i talking about it's, it moisturizes the hair whilst it washes it as you can see my hair is really i've got some weird texture like i'm not gonna lie like it's very soft it's not coarse um but yeah it kind of needs a lot of moisture yeah I would recommend this for anyone who has curly hair or really soft hair or is using a shampoo that is drying out your hair I've tried out so many different shampoos and this is the best one I would recommend so once I do that I then go on to this is the one I used yesterday it's got the same smell as the other one that I just showed you guys. This one's called the Coconut Cream Deep Conditioner. It's Auntie Jackie's um, as well, and I just tried to get a bit close, but I put this on my hair, and I'm telling you, my hair is like lava. It's, oh my girl, I didn't even know my hair could feel like that. I was using before this, which is Argan Oil, and it's from Cream of Nature. Let me take the press off it. It actually is really good if your hair's damaged. And like you guys know, I cut my hair off um, and I'm on this growth journey thing. So I'm super like antsy about what I use to wash my hair. I'm still trying to take the tag off, you know. <laughs> I don't know if anyone else is like that, but I just, I don't know. I just have this thing where I'm like, the tag needs to come off. Cause when people come to my house, I don't know if it's a Jamaican thing, yeah, but <laughs> it's like don't don't mind your business <laughs> and then like yeah. mind your business like you don't need to know how much we spend on my things <laughs> I'm joking but yeah anyway the tags are now <laughs> some resonance <laughs> but um yeah um this one is good but I, I again I was experimenting and I found that this one is much better than this one this one is like literally if I run out this one's sulfate free and um i believe this one is sulfate free as well i don't know much about the sulfate thing but something clearly is 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 working and this creates more suds i find um shampoos i was using before not much suds i could put like a drop and my whole entire hair just it suds up and then that lets me know that i've it's, it's washing correctly then if there's no suds like the little bubbles i'm like pouring more and more i don't know if anyone else finds that they do that but yeah this is great um and then like because i have like a hair dryer um i try to treat my hair which i haven't done for a while because i've just been a bit lazy i'm not gonna lie but that's the thing i know will grow my hair because i've done it before and my hair was just treating your hair is really good because it repairs all the damage um, from heat and um the air pollution I find that um so yeah I use this one to for the treatment again there's a tag on there <laughs> and it's not your business so that's gonna come off <laughs> it's nearly off it's nearly off guys oh my god I need to get it off get off I don't know why I'm there showing up my business this costs a lot I'm not gonna lie you have to invest in your hair otherwise you're just gonna have broke out hair crusty dry hair it's not gonna grow and yeah i um yeah i used 
this. It's called Instant Detangling Therapy. You can use it if you've got knots or you're trying to comb out dreads. This would be good. This is called Instant Detangling Therapy. Um, again, the smell, whew, it's just beautiful. It's always nice when it's a nice smell. If it smells like chemicals, then it's like, <coughs> that's not good. That's what I find anyway for myself because I've got that really, really sensitive smell. It's got shea butter and olive oil in it. I just put it close to the camera because I know that some people um, want to see. So when you go to the shop, they go and buy this one. And so I'm practicing my Jamaican accent. <laughs> but yeah, um, I'll use this for treating my hair now. But before I was using this, which I found quite heavy, I can't have too much oil in my hair. Otherwise, it'll just stick together. And it's just, once it, there's too much oil, it starts clamping. And I'll use this one, again there's a tag <laughs> on it, so that's coming off. <laughs> I don't know why I don't just take it off when I get you though, like seriously, I think it's the fact that I'm showing you lot now, so I'm like people can see my business, so I need to make sure I come correct. But yeah, this one is CPR treatment anti-breakage lotion. I had a lot of breakage, especially when I was growing my hair, um, I noticed there was like, a lot of hair coming out into the brush um and it was just not very healthy so i was using this a lot um it smells beautiful it is a, it does smell a bit chemically if i'll be honest um but yeah this is for more um like if your hair is super dry and you need to um get some kind of moisture put back into the hair i would recommend this um there's a brush that I use brush. It's got a bit of hair in it at the moment. Um, this is for like detangling. Then I part it when I'm in the shower with this one. And then when I go to blow dry it, what I do is I part it in four once all the conditioner's out. This one, I'll comb it out with, I put this in, this is like the conditioner for me because it's like deep conditioning. And then I will comb it through with the conditioner. Then I'll rinse it out. And then when I go to blow dry it after coming out of um, the treatment, I part it with this. Then I brush it through with this, because this is detangled. And then once I've come with this, I then blow dry it with this. And then once I blow dry it with this, I then get this once it's completely dry and I start fluffing it. That's how I blow dry my hair. Anyway, once my hair's all dry, I then use it. Oh god, this has got a tag on it. So. <laughs> In the middle of my business, yes. So I'm taking off the tag again. Oh my god, you see my floor right now. <laughs> um, yeah, I kind of like use this one, the pink. Cause it's light i don't like after i put so much of this in my hair i don't want to be putting thick grease in my i was about to say something really rude then i don't i won't put this on while i'm blow drying because i'm not gonna cook my hair my hair is not eggs <laughs> so i'm not blow drying my hair with this it's way too thick it smells great by the way i'll show you the product i'm using this one it's called indian hemp um i don't blow dry with oil to be cooking up my headpiece no i don't know where that idea and that philosophy came from but mm -mm. It, it, that just cooks your hair i use something light see how this nearly finishes it's expensive it's like a, i'll just spray it it's like a light mist that's what i will put on my hair not no thick grease 
this I use when I came row my hair. I will put this on after between the cracks. So then that can kind of give my hair that deep oil. I don't know. I don't know what it's called. Like philosoph hair philosopher. I just use what I know what <laughs> and this is how my hair grows. It got quite caught moisture so it's kind of fluffed up a bit, but I'll just show you how my hair has really like grown since cutting it. This is my hair. So my hair now. I'm not trying to, you know, people like, my hair is proper long, like, I hate that. My hair actually comes to hair now. If I was to straighten it. So, this way of doing my hair is actually working. So, first, this, to wash. I give it about three washes and just do that with my hair. Don't wash my nails, guys. You really saw that. <laughs> and then, I use this as moisturizer to comb through again wait about five minutes in the shower and then rinse it all out and then this for treatment to go under the dryer you need cling film or a under dryer cat if there is one um this is my hair guys this is this is the, the um i'll just sit back so you can kind of see um, and then to blow dry it, I use the oil, it's um, the glosser, it's got shea butter in it as well, I, I think I'm a shea butter fanatic. It's not too heavy, as you can see, it's not a heavy oil, it's just a light oil, just to give it that, you know, so it doesn't get completely dry, but then you don't want to cook your hair. And I'll be parting with this, I'll be combing through the knots with this. Then I'll blow dry with this. And then if I wanna get my hair dead straight before I straighten it, I'll be using this, which I stole from my sister. <laughs> Ages ago. No, you can't have it back. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> but yeah, basically that's how um, I've been like kind of growing my hair. Um, that's what kind of works for me and then like if i want to slick my hair i will use the following i'll just get it for you guys styling it to like get it like this in this slick like puff puff i will use the eco this is the max hold 10 and dax so this will keep my hair like this all i was gonna say something rude then again <laughs> I'll keep it, keep my hair all day and this has got a tag on it as well. Um, you can get these from your nearest packs or order on Amazon. Um, so my favourite, these are my favourite products at the moment. So I just wanted to like show you guys, um, this is my hair journey and I'm hoping to grow my hair really long. My mum's hair is like here, so I'm kind of, now that I've gone natural, I'm kind of like attempting to try to grow my hair really long. Um, I'm going to try the rice treat. Is it a rice challenge and we'll see what happens um but i will um be doing that to see if it works because i keep seeing all these videos and i'm like oh. but yeah i just wanted to show you guys these are the products i'm using <laughs> i'm trying to attempt to hold all of them but yeah um these are I say black girl essentials. I feel like white people can use them as well. Any any race can really use these. If your hair is quite thick and you need something to help you maintain the, I don't know, the strength of your hair, these products are, I would say, the best. I've tried everything. I'm telling you, I have tried everything. Auntie Jackie, Pink Mist, um, Glossar from Lusters, and... Um, this one, cream of nature, is good, especially if you want to dye your hair. Motions, great for treatment, for repair if your hair's damaged. Um, and then for styling, the Eco Gel and Dax. And you just need a nice slick brush. I can show you guys. Did I want slick brush? Yeah, this, this is a slick brush to get it all crisp and that. Um, yeah, thank me later. So in the shower, I usually use a mask wash, Neutrogena, um, 
I had it somewhere in my house and I don't know where it is. When I do find it, I will attach it to this video. Um, so I wash with the um, soap, like uh, a soap with no fragrance or chemicals in it. And then I will then use this um, Neutrogena, it smells beautiful. It's the watermelon version and it's a daily exfoliator. And then once I wash it all off, I'll just pat my face. I won't dry my face like this. <laughs> I'll just pat. And then because it's usually when you've exfoliated, you feel like a stingy feeling, not really a stingy feeling, but like more of a like, you can tell something's been done. I then put on um, aloe vera, which you can get from Amazon. And now I'll just like, I'll just show you what I'll do. I won't put too much, but I'll just kind of put like a little bit on like that. And I'll just let it, dry into my skin and then once it, I feel like it's all dried I'll then rinse it off and then um, I'll like use like um, baby oil um, and then that's it really and my skin's just been getting better since I've been doing that and that's like my morning um, routine for my skin so I'm not wearing any makeup um, I do have a few bare mishes, but it was so much worse. This is from like PMSN. Um, but you can see natural glow. I've got my natural concealer. <laughs> no shade. <laughs> it's just natural. Um, but yeah, that's what I've been doing, and I've, I've really seen a massive. I've seen a massive change since using this um, brand Neutrogena. I feel like. Again, they're the best. I've used a lot of different um, products, but this one here is the best. So I just wanted to show you guys, to take care of yourself. Um, Self-love is um, high energy, um, so make sure that you're doing it. Um, all right. <laughs> Thanks for watching. This is the Becky Effect, giving you all the hair essentials. Bye.